Welcome into Fast Five with Jay Walker and Scott Prather. What's up, everybody? Welcome into Fast Five. We haven't done this show together in about a month. Now is as good a time as any. Let's go. True or false, the Saints defense is more likely to finish in the bottom four of the league than 27th or higher. False. I just think having a new defensive coordinator and having some new schemes is going to make them better. They may not be much higher than 27th, but I think they'll be higher. It's true. It's true. Oh, it's true. Now, to your point, I think Dennis Allen simplifying things will help, but the injuries, man. Sheldon Rankins, broken fibula, Kakaha, done. Anthony Hurt should be ready for week one, but new position, young defense, key players getting injured, bottom four. Quit your crying. Battle round, pick a side. Is Michael Phelps a better Olympian than Usain Bolt? Uh, that would be false. Usain Bolt is a better Olympian. Think about it. Anybody that can walk can compete in what he does. Whereas there's a lot more limited, like the pool is not as big, pun intended, for swimming. Three straight Olympics, three golds in the 100 meter, never been done before, I'm going with Bolt. Uh, that's probably the dumbest analogy I've ever heard, but you know, okay, he's won the 100 three times in a row. Not me. Michael Phelps won an event four consecutive Olympics. Tell, you, tell Usain, Usain, insane Bolt to come see me when he does it in 2020 in Tokyo. Different sport. Donkey round, you only have seven seconds. Will the Raging Cajun football team be settled at quarterback by week one? Yes, because HUD said it would be. I don't think so. I think they're going to have a guy out there and they're going to roll with him, but there's a lot of uncertainty at that spot right now. Who am I kidding? Yes. Donkey round two. Will LSU running back Leonard Fournette win the Heisman Trophy? No, uh, I hope he does, but will they beat Alabama? Will they be in the national championship picture? If you believe that, then the answer is yes, but no. I, I, I was going to say the same thing. My answer is yes because LSU is going to be in the national championship picture. Therefore, uh. winner and loser of the week. Loser of the week. How about Hope Solo? Solo, the goalie for the women's a national soccer team what a loser. really showed what a loser she is after she was a loser in that match against Sweden. She decided to rip the Swedes, didn't give them any credit, said they were cowards for the way they played. Hope. Win with class, don't show your ass. Well said, Jay. Winner of the week, this community. In the toughest of times, everybody comes together, and for everybody out there, lending a helping hand, uh, helping out their neighbor, helping out strangers, digging up ditches, pulling up carpets, pulling you know damaged rubble from the flood to the curb. Everyone continues to do it, and in the toughest of times, we're reminded why this area, South Louisiana, is the best place to live in the world. You're the winners this week, and we couldn't be more proud to be residents of this great area. I got nothing to say except that's it for Fast Five. We'll see you again next week.